Hey guys, before this video starts, I just want to say, if you don't like how my I don't post frequently enough, then this is because I stream a lot. I stream Monday, Wednesday, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, around 1.45, my time. Um, I'll put my time in the thing, because currently I, in the description, I don't know about it. But yeah, go check out my Twitch if you want more content from me, and yeah, it would be greatly appreciated. Now on to the video. Yo, what's up guys? Welcome to the video. Today I'm doing some parkour map review. This is the parkour with me map. Um, it's really fun. I downloaded it. The download link will be in the link in the description. But, yeah, so, let's get started. Um, I've played this a little, so I have three levels open. You have to finish the parkour to open the next level, which I think is kind of cool. I I'm excited for this level, but I have to defeat the sky level and then the desert temple level. But for now, let's go to the first one. Well, one thing I like about this is there's easy, normal, hard. I've been playing it on normal, but for video purposes, it's going to be easy. Um, the only difference between normal and easy is, and like hard, is how fast the ghost goes, because you're competing against a ghost. Me, I'm not very good at parkour, so I just do parkour because I think it's fun. So let's, let's see. I already failed. See, he doesn't miss a jump, but he goes slower. But it's pretty fun parkour. And you can get there. Okay, the ghost is really messing me up. Wait, did I not get the checkpoint? Uh, so there's a gold block that you have to make blue um, at, the, at each checkpoint. I really like this map. If you're not very good at parkour, then it's this first level is a great way to practice. Because on this first level, you're learning all the basic, doing all the basic jumps, and yeah, this is just a really great thing. Exactly. All right, so. I'm almost done with this. Oh, apparently there's no checkpoint right here. Checkpoint's over there. So I gotta get to that checkpoint. And this great thing about this map is that there's like, it's exotic. So it's not just straight up parkour. See, it does that thing. When it turns gold, you know you have the checkpoint. And it, it's just really fun and easy. So that's one of the pros about this map. Then there's also your first slime jump, which I somehow failed. I mean, I've never been the best at slime jumps. I'm pretty terrible at them. Oh, I jumped over the slime. But, yeah, I, I'm being really quiet right now because I'm, like, concentrated on the parkour. See, I'm, I messed that up, but let's go look at the other map. I'm just going to be covering the first three maps because those are the maps I've covered. But if you guys want me to cover these other maps that there are um, in a different video, then, then I'll... I'll definitely do that, because I personally like parkour, it's just I'm not very good at it, obviously, but, yeah. Oh, apparently, that's, the volume is very loud, so you, for this map, you might want to turn your master volume down, and in this map, you learn more about ladder parkour, and you get emphasis more on slime jumps. 
like this map I really started learning about slime jumps because I had never really done slime jumps. So there's that. So the slime jumps took me a while on this map. And you catch the ladder. So sliming onto ladders was like difficult for me because at the time I had a terrible keyboard that like didn't respond. So like I'd press W or I'd press W or D and it wouldn't respond. And then this is like the first ladder parkour. Can you move, ghost? And ladder parkour I personally really enjoy. Uh, I just walked. Because that's the thing about ladder parkour. You gotta have... And you can't just jump straight into it. Because the block will distract you. So you gotta like get on top of it. Then jump around on top of it. But yeah. Overall I think this is a... Once you get past the ladder parkour. It's really just slime jumps. And then the finish. So, we're gonna look at the sky map now. So, the sky map is the map I'm currently working on. So, I haven't gotten too far in it. So, yeah. In this, there's like these green blocks. So, you start, seems pretty chill. I mean, it is pretty chill. Those green blocks, I got stumped on because I didn't know what they did. These green blocks, it gives you a jump boost. And this, I thought I was supposed to jump to there, and I was like, what, how? But then I saw that, so. And. See, I don't know how that happens. That's the thing that annoys me about slime jumps. That'll just happen, and I have no idea how. But, overall, I think this map is a great map. I totally suggest downloading it if you're down for parkour. If you rage, but you, like, you're fine with raging, then I guess you could get it. I'm a big rager myself, but the reason I'm... Like, I rage if I just have spent five hours on a single level. If I'm progressing and learning how to do it, I don't rage. But, I totally recommend this map, and... Yeah, this is a map review. I did another map review because my American Ninja Warrior map review got a lot of views and you guys seem to like it. So, yeah. Um, I think that's going to be it for this video, but yeah, if you want me to teach you guys how to download it, um, I'm pretty sure these maps are like, ex like, you can't get these maps on like mobile. I think it's like, you could get it on Xbox, and you can get it on Java Edition. That's, I know that much. You can get them on Java Edition. So, I'm not sure if you can get it on Java Edition on other platforms, because yes, you can get Java Edition on other platforms, but I'm not sure if you can get it on those other platforms, even if you do have Java Edition, because you can get Java Edition through Xbox, I believe. So, yes, that is a reason. Alright, why does that exist? Wherever it is. But, yeah guys, I think I'm gonna end off. Um, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video, I guess. Peace out.